Hello, welcome to my channel. My name is Aziza. I'm reading today for the sign of Virgo for love and relationship for the month of June Your person is afraid that you are cheating on them. Even if you are the one who is really thinking that maybe they got someone else the whole time, they are suspicious about you too. Your person does not have someone else. You keep thinking that way in the past few months. You are succeeding with this person. They love you so much. They care for you a lot. There is a lot on your mind like you know, against this person. You love him or her, but you cannot help it to accuse them because the way they behave with you. You are succeeding at work or if you're seeking like, you know, really overtime work, more work, another part-time job, a business. It sounds to me that you are going to be really connected really very well and you will have money. But a lot of you, it seems like you know, that you are afraid to get busy. You don't want to get busy. You are kind of like, no, I don't want other people to rely on me. Why I don't rely on them? This is when you fall apart and you don't continue. You are uncommittal sometimes. Life is getting ahead with you, in front of you. It's coming to you. It's kind of like, okay, go and search. We will, we will make you find like you know, what you search for. The universe is really working with you, but when you stop, nothing is working. The other person I get here that, you know, they, they, you are the one in your life. Like, you know, they seem like you know, that you are the one. They do understand they are wrong. They know you don't trust them. They don't trust you either. We said that already. But they are being careful about their words to you. They don't want to give you that highly confident 100% but sometimes when they feel you are slipping away for real, they tell you just to hold you there. And you are like, what is this? Am I being played with? Yeah, since you have been doubting yourself a lot, stop it. Straighten out your thinking and your mind. What is this? You're too emotional, too sensitive about things. You live in your head. I want to leave. I'm undecided. I'm back and forth. I want this. I don't want him. I don't want her. I want this. I'm no. I'm going to continue. No, I don't. Make up your mind because you are between back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. There is someone in fear from your past occupy your mind really very much that you want to go back with. Even if you think that you really moved on from that person, but it seems to be that you did not really. They're still there. Living here, living here in your heart. Make up your mind about what you want. You're smart enough, beautiful, attractive. You attract anybody to you. If you choose to, you're confident, you're for it. You don't, you don't have any minus. The only minus in you that you don't really trust yourself enough. You're going to be busy if you choose to be really doing this business that has been really on your mind the past, like, you know, two years and a half. Or a year and a half. Actually, two years and a half. <laughs> That's what I'm assuming. Okay, three years. Don't be upset. Making videos, movies. Here we go. Videos or movies. You will step up. You will make really a lot. You will be busy. You will be your own boss. You will accomplish a lot. You will become even rich. Look at that. 
stop of watching your partner. He did something or she. They are doing it. They are messing around. No, they are not messing around. They are just fooling you. They have emotional problem. They, they're going to get out of it too. That's really good for you. This person hasn't been, re been reliable, but they are lucky at this time. It seems to be they are going back with their job or something. And I get here, your work is going to be really improving. You have your foundation, your business. They're going to own a home. If you don't own a home already, if you establish that business, it's going to be really, really very good for you. You will be, oh my God, I wish I did that before. Financially, really very good. Some, some of you are like going on spirituality a lot also. Your person wants you to be proposing to be their wife or husband. They want you to be really there. They told you already that you have a great connection, you have so much love. A lot of you choosing another relationship. A lot of you going back to someone from your past. A lot of you having a new relationship. A lot of you, like, you know, see him thinking about a new relationship, talking, chatting, flirting. They stop because you are in love with the person. You are with right now. But the other person haven't really, like, you know, getting together with themselves yet. For them to be really judged more, it's about time for them to step up. They will. There is love, there is commitment, there is marriages for people who are not married. It looks to me a new beginning, and that new beginning is really ripe in right now. But for others, it's not really too ripe yet, because they're still thinking about it. Mm. Have a grip on your emotions and start your business or start this new relationship or someone that you want to go back with and really make up your mind, because here, you keep changing your mind a lot that you are killing your spirit and other spirit. You're not making up your mind about something. That's the up and down. I want really like no really cake or candy today. No, 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 I stop. I need this uh, McDonald's or something. Or I, I mean, I, I need like you know, some uh, hamburger. Okay. We get that. No, 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 I need the sweets. No, I need the cake. Oh, no, hamburger. No. Stop it. Make up your mind and go on with it because you are afraid. You kind of like you don't trust you. You don't know what you want. Even though sometimes they say the answer is within yourself. Every person know what they want, but they have to be really like you know, in touch with their emotions, mind and spirit to understand what their motive Step ahead and let go of that fear. A lot of you that, you know, you have plans, wishes, and you are so extremely lucky, but you still borrowing money from people, relying on a source for the money to come to you, and it's going to come to you. You will get it. But why? You can do it. You just don't want to work. That's it. It's your choice at the end. If you are seeking like you know, that marriage that you didn't really marry a person like you know, for a certain person a long time ago, it seems to be that you might really not going with it unless you see the other person like you know, stepping up. Some of you is going to do it. Some of you have done it already. There's another fall down. Like, you, know, you keep really like you know, getting up in your emotions and you fall down. Like, you know, I see that turmoil. Enough of enough, you know, this is the time really to have a grip on your emotions and feelings and do things. This is when you have self, like, you know, the control, the upper hand, the key in your hand, you can do it. If you do it, you will succeed in love and work and money situation. But I still see you, like, you know, not accomplishing a lot. Some of you, yes, but not everybody, like, you know, you don't want to accomplish a lot. You still want to need people. Why you need people? You are too smart for this. It's better to rely on yourself. 
This is what you need that you are missing a long time ago. You become confident, then you lose it again. You lose yourself. Are you shy? Are you embarrassed? You keep really asking people like you to help you. You can help yourself. That's your life. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the reading, dear Virgo. And if you need a private reading, please contact me. And the link for my website is below this video, mysticalaziza.com. You don't need to email me and ask about the prices. Just check the website, mysticalaziza.com. Click on reading prices. Purchase your reading, then give me a call. And the phone number is listed on my website. Thank you so much for watching. Bye-bye.